DCA air temperature controls come factory programmed as do all controls supplied by DCA. The connections to the dehumidifier are made at terminals located either on the outside of the unit, such as those seen here, or they may be on a terminal strip located inside of the electrical compartment, in this case located at the bottom of the compartment. All terminals with the same number are electrically identical. The 1s or 1As are the hot wire for the transformer and the 2s are the transformers common. Sensor wiring on this example involves sensor A only and the two sensor wires are connected to the top two terminals of sensor A on the controller. On the power strip schematic you will notice a number 1A next to the wire protruding from the positive terminal. This means that that terminal connects to a 1A terminal on the dehumidifier. The number 2 next to it on the C or common means that it is to be connected to a number 2 terminal and so forth for all connections. An earth ground is required on the third terminal of the power strip. On the relays or outputs beneath, the center terminals labeled COM are not wired to the common terminal on the power strip. They are, as indicated by the number 1A, to be connected to a corresponding terminal on the dehumidifier. You may wish to simply pigtail off the 1A on the power strip and connect to the three relays as indicated. Relay number 4 is not used in this installation. Next to the COMs are normally open terminals with the numbers 4, 5, and 6, which indicate the corresponding terminal connection on the dehumidifier as mentioned earlier. Be certain that you are on the normally open, or in some cases the normally closed terminals as indicated on the schematic for your installation. Relays or outputs 1 and 2 are part of loop 1, the heating loop which controls an external heat source such as a gas-fired furnace or an electric duct heater. Relay number 3 is part of loop 2, the cooling loop which controls a flow of hot gas to a remote condenser or other such device when air cooling is required. It should be remembered that the unit is dehumidifying whenever the compressor is running regardless of the mode of operation. The loops must remain as they are. Changing loop 1 to cool would only mean, for example, that a furnace is being activated in an attempt to cool the room. If you need to change the set points, the instructions can be found in the DCA installation manual on our website or you can call DCA.